What is this doing in my hallway? Free carpet. That is absolutely disgusting. <laughs> Do you want that free carpet? No. <laughs> yeah, right? Like, well, I don't want that. Like, at least roll it up. You can see the riding on the pavement. Young kids that grow up in basement. This is the Mount Pleasant Farmer's Market. <laughs> and it is extremely busy this time of the day. Yeah. Got your kimchi and pickled things over here. Got your mushrooms over here. Area's looking real nice. That looks so good. There's the rest of the produce. Then you have a lollipop, or not lollipop, oh my god, popsicles. These are fantastic. What's the flavors today? Strawberry, kiwi, pineapple, ginger, strawberry, lemonade. Ooh, strawberry, kiwi? Might have to. So we got the uh, Jerusalem style falafel. If your Saturday doesn't have this, it's not gonna be good. This is like the best. The line will be down the block. Jerusalem style. <laughs> and we got puppers everywhere. Thank you. Oh, thank you, ma'am. Always good seeing you. Good luck. Give you a nice little pan. This falafel is absolutely busting. Literally, but like also like. What did you get? Oh, yeah, I can tell you. Where'd you get tamales? I didn't. I didn't even know about those. What? And like over time. Talking to a friend over here. Basically, just kind of like buying dinner whenever they. Guys, the Riz is strong today. Just got Hannah's number. It's not even noon yet. Now she's cute. Oh my god! I think I fell in love for like two seconds. She lives close too. I hit her up. We'll grab some drinks. See what happens. Hannah lied. There are absolutely no strawberries here. I'm hella disappointed. But we got apples. So I don't think fruit are in season yet, but apples always seem to be. We'll grab some pink ladies and some snow sweets. Oh. Just learned of a new concept called flower bombing, where you literally take one of these and you throw it, and it grows into a patch of flowers. Thank you. Seed bomb. Oh, seed bomb, there you go. Flower bomb, seed bomb. I will happily bomb some stuff for you. Thank you. Thank you. That's really cool. So let's go, let's go flower bomb somewhere ugly. We gotta do it now. I don't wanna take this inside. I found the perfect place to flower bomb right here. She said somewhere ugly. This is kind of ugly. So, all right, check this out. Flower bomb. Kind of looks like falafel. Kind of looks like a piece of doo doo. Kind of smells like a piece of doo doo. We're going to throw it right here. I guess we'll wait. But not today. Good man, how are you? Good. Dude, Sam. Really? Look at this thing. It's my vlog camera. This is Sam. He's my doormate. Hello. We both suffer together. <laughs> Sam. Have you heard about this bed bug infestation? Yeah. What's your thoughts on that? Uh, they come and go. Aren't you scared? Of bed bugs? Yeah. It's not like they got a knife to my throat. Maybe to your balls. Sir, disabled veteran. I'm sorry, sir. Your... Here's where you compost. Yeah. Huh? How long you been saving that garbage for, Sam? This is a week's play. Ooh, that's not that much. No. I need that. Thank you. Thank you. How do you how do you look at this all day? Hmm? How do you look at the compost the all day? Is, the smell is yeah, something else. It is like we shut that one. Yeah. Um, the smell it. It's gonna be hot too. Oh my god! It kind of looks nice. It's the smell of it. Just plunge it. Yeah. It. You know what? Respect. Respect. <laughs> well, I'm peacing. See ya. I'm gonna go hit the gym. Enjoy. Yeah. Enjoy the market. I'm going to get coffee. Oh, that sounds nice. See you later. See you, Sam. Goodbye, old friend. But don't don't say I don't care about the environment. Yeah. Wow, look at you out here waiting for Prince Charming. Oh, my <laughs> oh you're selling your plants. Yeah. 
Oh, never mind. Maybe he'll come. The customer who will buy them all. Yeah, maybe he'll come buy all your plants. Are you moving? No. Okay. I just have too many plants. That's a lot. These are all in your apartment. I have like seventy plants. I think you have. Nothing. I think you have an addiction. Well, I clearly don't because I'm selling them. It's true. I respect the hustle. I'm, Which one is forty dollars? The one with the circular leaves. This one? Yeah. This? It's ugly. It's not. How dare you? This is. Why you is don't this? Even know her. Why is this forty dollars? It's not forty dollars, but I bet I could get forty dollars if I asked. So what's the most expensive plant? The one right in front of you with the big leaves. This one? What kind of plant is it? It's a monstera deliciosa. Did you just say a Harry Potter spell on me? <laughs> we have your first customer. This is my third customer. Okay, never mind. Never mind. She's selling. She's selling. Wait, which one are you looking at? Um, okay, I was looking at the little yeah, monstera, maybe, because I don't have one. This one? Or maybe a cutting? I don't know. Ooh. These are the cuttings. Is this like, a documentary on the plants? I'm just a YouTuber. Don't mind me. I'm... $40. It's not true. Oh. Not true. It's $5. Out here wheeling and dealing. So if you just put one wedding cake. This is cool. Yes. That's what happens. She's a plant hustler. Okay. This is crazy. Maybe I should sell plants. Cute girl's time to just walk up. This is the rarest one. I think I saw your Facebook post. It goes. Another Facebook post? I know. You laughed at me, said I was a grandma for being on Facebook. <laughs> Happens. <laughs> this is not your platform. <laughs> he's mad because he's all about TikTok. I'm not mad about I respect. You can I respect. Do both. Like, yeah, you should do both. <laughs> yeah. You can be a TikTok plant lady. Um, I can't believe this. Facebook Marketplace going crazy. Did you find out about this from Facebook? Oh my god. I told you, Bruce. I told you. I can't. I told you. I will never doubt Facebook ever again in my life. See, Facebook Marketplace, it's like, you never know what you're going to find, so I always peruse like twice yeah. a week. Mm -hmm. oh. I'm a plant daddy now. I hear selling plants. Um, I'm based plant daddy. <laughs> okay, take that plant, I'll sell it to you for five, and we'll hold on to it until you're done. Deal? You got it. How about for you? I want the purple one. This one? Yep. Here. And how much is the, um, like to touch it? the string of pearls. ball one, the pearl one? It's 30. Let me check that the person who said they were going to come by is still coming by. Have they paid you yet? They have not paid me. <laughs> ah, money speaks. Mm. <laughs> Outbid them. Yeah, I would too. Oh, that's so cool. I didn't see string that. String of pearls are amazing. That's amazing. I really want to. Wow, they look like peas. Cool. Yeah, they <laughs> yeah, like the cutest oh. peas. What? Oh, that is so God. cool. Turn and show them its little tiny roots. Oh! You can see it's got like little tiny baby roots. Oh my god. But it's been in there for a long time, so it should be all the way rooted. Can I pass this back to you? Of course. You were you were into it. I don't so, I don't really think it's my vibe. Congrats on your new plants. Yay! You should take I'm also looking at this. She's absolutely that crazy. Stripey boy? boy? It's a plant game. I need to start selling plants. What the fuck? Yeah. I didn't figure out how to take it. She sold so many plants in like ten minutes. Off a of Facebook post. I need to get off Facebook. It's crazy. So for my hard work, I got a, I got a plant now. Yeah. I'm now an official plant daddy. Yeah, I've got a. What do you think of that? She's beautiful. She's beautiful. She's beautiful. What's her name? I gotta name it. Priscilla. Like Priscilla. Do you think we're Beatrice? Okay, so Beatrice. Beatrice. Yes, Beatrice. Priscilla. Okay. I like Priscilla. I'll the first thing that came to mind. Okay. Great. Cool. This is my new friend Kyla, by the way. Hello, I'm Kyla. Cool. She's and my a, new friend Bruce. She's an extreme biker. Cool. I'm an extreme, extreme, extreme sports person. Extreme biker. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> crash, try not to this time. If we're not gonna crash. Traumatic brain injury. I'm taking it on her first Vespa ride. Day. Wait, it's not your first one, is it? It's my first one! That's what's up. What the have our main character moment. <laughs> How was the first Vespa ride? I can't stop. I can't get enough. <laughs> Take me away. <laughs> <laughs> Look, like she had such a good time. Yeah, <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Oh, that was good. How was that? I had to put my helmet on because it was crazy in there. Damn. I got a concussion. Oh my goodness. Crazy in the wind was. I'll see ya. Good luck on the bike. Thank you. I'll see ya. Hope to see you soon. Let's see, I would never condone drunk driving. I'm not drunk. I had a drink. But this just makes the ride better. Drinking and driving is different from drunk driving. Exactly. Exactly. I'm below the limit. I swear. That's concerning to me that you have to justify that. No, well, I'm just saying. Like, uh, it's just a little bit. Sounds it makes like it feel better. Oh my god. Yeah. What do you say? PewDiePie. What? Yes, if I had a YouTube channel. Wait, what just happened? Yes, if I had a YouTube channel. People see a camera and they freak out. It's like they lose all kinds of self control when they see <laughs> someone holding a camera. It's really ridiculous. Dear God. I'd like to thank you for this heat wave. The amount of sundresses I have seen this weekend have been off the charts, and I am losing my damn mind. I am just a heat in. I am a simple man. I will be sending all weekend and ask for forgiveness on Sunday. Maybe next Sunday, if it's still hot. These dresses are crazy. Amen. All right, so now, the building, Look at the building. Damn, it's an insane asylum. But now, it's time to go bartend for the first time in a long time. Uh, honestly, I randomly met the owner of the comedy club right around the corner, and I, I said, hey, if you need help, I'd love to help. Because one, it's chill, I'm not making craft cocktails, just opening beers. It's, I couldn't ask for a better thing, and I get a free comedy show. And, hopefully I make some money. So we'll see how this works out. I wouldn't mind picking up a few shifts a week. So we gotta get there, park the Vespi, I don't know, just laugh our ass off for the next few hours. You do computer forensics? What does that mean? Like you find a Whew, that was a long, that was a long bartending shift. Just parked the Vespi down here in DuPont Circle. It's wild out here. Uh, my eyes feel so like baked. Even though I didn't smoke at all, my eyes just feel like shot. But these are night owls. These are night hours. These are our hours. We are a walker of the night but we don't sell no booty. <laughs> so we're gonna go over to 12 after 12 and actually do a paid brand deal, which is cool because I'd have been going anyway. So they pay me to do what I would have done anyways. Epic house music. My friend Brooke is there who is talking to one of the owners or she's friends with one of the owners. So she's been hitting me up and yeah, I'm all around excited. Uh, I'm just curious to see how they feel about my shorts, but I'm a guest of honor, so they don't matter anyways. The perks, the perks. And of course, I'll be drinking free the entire time because that's just how it does. I don't got paper shit. The perks of being a professional alcoholic on TikTok. I found the best club in DC. We don't deserve this, but maybe we do. This place is a maze to your favorite destination. It's Alice in Wonderland done right and equally as trippy. The main room is an open air atrium with cuckoo clocks and bird cages hanging overhead. The giant LED panels behind the bar illuminate you just enough to see all your money disappearing into some gin and tonics. Break away from the madness and there's multiple vibes to choose from in this labyrinth of a club. If you want live performance, head to the blue room. Never thought I'd see a keyboardist and bongo player jam over some jungle house beats. Journey upstairs, and there are small dark rooms for you to discover. It's a perfect spot to lose your friends or steal a kiss from a lucky stranger. And once it all becomes too much, you can decompress in the red room and take selfies to your camera roll is full. Good luck getting in past the football team of bouncers. You better know someone. But once you do, paradise. This is 12 After 12. Oh my god. That was crazy. That might be actually one of the craziest clubs in DC. I'm not gonna lie. That was a fucking vibe. I like that a lot. But, um... Managed to not get too drunk. Had a few drinks, had some hookah. It's time to get home. I'm gonna sleep in so hard tomorrow. This is gonna be a triumphant ride home. I wish I could record while I was riding the Vespa, but I can't, because I'd kill myself. But just know, I'm gonna feel like the main character. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Hope you enjoy the day in the life. This day was so crazy, it kinda makes me feel like a sociopath. So there's that. See ya.